I'm Amy from Peekaboo Pattern Shop and today we're going to be taking a look at the Aspen Pullover. I'm just going to show you how this nursing access works and give you a few tips on sewing it. So the Aspen has pockets that are formed from this front panel. So you have an opening down here at the bottom and this is for your hand for your pocket. And then further up you have your nursing access. So there's a gap left here on both sides and that opens up to your under layer. So I'm gonna turn this inside out real quickly to show you a little better how that works. So looking at this from the inside, this is our nursing panel and it has a gap left in the center and that's what gives you your nursing access from the panel over on the front side. And I've had a few people comment that what they've done to make this even quicker to sew is instead of cutting the nursing panel out, they just cut their regular front and then they just cut a slit right down the middle. And if you aren't bothered by not having a perfectly finished edge, see this one's got a, a nice edge to it, but if you don't care, knit fabric's not gonna fray. You can just cut a regular front piece and just cut a hole and you'll be good to go. So the way we sew this together, turn this right side out again. On your pattern piece, you're gonna to wanna to look at your pocket pattern piece. It has a few different markings. I kind of highlighted them for you. So you've got the star markings. Those are for your nursing access. And then you're gonna have just a dot that that's for your pocket. So when you're getting ready to assemble your pocket piece, you need to finish the edge on everywhere that it's going to open up. So between the side seam and the pocket dot marking and then in between the two stars. So that's these sections right here. So you're gonna sew on your trim and then you will top stitch from here to here and from here to here. And once you have that done, then you lay the pocket piece on top of your front panel and then you sew down from the top to where the first star, which is gonna be the start of your nursing access. And then you'll have an opening and then you'll top stitch again from the bottom of your nursing access to the top of your pocket. And that's what holds the panel in place. And one thing that is noted in the tutorial is you may wanna add a little bit of interfacing to the bottom of your nursing access. So right here, Mine I noticed I was starting to get a little hole. I didn't add the interfacing on mine. I need to go back and do that. This is just kind of a stress point on your pattern. So if you add a little bit of interfacing right here and then when you do your top stitching, so this is at the bottom of your nursing access. When you do your top stitching, instead of just ending right here, I would do a little bit of stitching going sideways and that'll just keep all the stress from being in one little tiny spot when you're opening it up. So let's just take one more look at our nursing access. So it opens here and then you pull from the underside and that's how it works. I've had a few people ask how they could alter this for if you're wanting to nurse and pump at the same time or double pump, because right now it would really be pretty difficult to try and open this up enough to do that. It works well for one side, but if you're wanting dual access, what I would do is take your front pattern piece, so this is the regular front, not the nursing front. Lay your pocket on top of it and trace that edge so you know where the edge of the pocket is. And after you've done that, mark a couple inches from the center fold line over. This is two inches over and draw a line down and then just cut your pattern piece apart and so you'll cut a left and a right side so two mirror images of the side and then a center panel on the fold and when you cut them make sure you're adding a seam allowance to both of these pieces otherwise it's going to end up way too small the first time i tried this uh, you can see my line right here i did a kind of an angle and it was really maybe only an inch and a half away from the edge of my pocket. And it was a little too close. I have trouble keeping that so it just stays shut all the time and I'm a little 
worried I'm gonna have a wardrobe malfunction. So make sure by drawing your pocket opening here, you're gonna want you know, a good two and a half, three inches between your nursing access and the edge of your pocket where it's gonna be open just to make sure everything stays right where it belongs. So that's what I would do. If you don't wanna mess with multiple pieces, you could just cut the front on the fold and then just cut a slit over on the left and one over on the right and be done with it. If you're not worried about the raw edges, that would work just fine. So that's all about the nursing access on the Aspen and that is included in your pattern.